Hello GGP friends, today we are at the laundry room in one of the apartment buildings in the city and we will wash clothes, okay? Come with me. We are going to show you how to put money in the laundry cart. This is the laundry cart. Most of the apartments use these type of carts to do your laundry. Okay, first we need to place the card here. It shows that we have $2 balance in the account. Now we want to add more money. We need our debit card. Then we will insert the card. Continue, yes. And then we have to choose the amount. $10, $25 or more. In this case, we will use $10. $10, okay? Okay. From checking account in this case, and then I have to enter the pin number. Now we have to take off the debit card. Okay, now the balance in the card is $12. Okay, some machines do not have this card reader and you have to do both things using this device. The debit card first and then you have to enter the laundry card in the same slot. When it happens, the card has a little chip here. If the card doesn't have a chip, it's because the machine is like these ones. And that's it, we have $12 to do our laundry today. Okay, so I'm gonna show you how to use the washing machine and the dryer when you have an apartment. Usually the laundry machine is on the basement. In this case, we have two washing machines, two dryers, and I'm gonna show you how to use it. Here is the washing machine when it's closed. When you open the lid, you will find the instructions here. And the instructions are very easy. Number one, we have to add detergent first. So we add detergent, now we have to add the clothes, try to make piles of clothes like for example these are jackets and try not to mix them with delicate fabric or with white colors, always try to separate your laundry by colors, by textures and in this case we are washing jackets, sweaters, and some tucks and gloves. Okay, this is number two. Do not fill up um, the laundry machine because it will not uh, wash it properly. Just make it loose and it will be fine. Number three, we have to close the lid and then it's time for us to use our laundry cart. Once we have the lid closed, then we have to set up the temperature and the type of washing that we want. In this case, we are going by for normal, medium, and then we just need to tap the laundry cart into this slot. It says $12, now it's asking us to push, and the amount of money that we are getting uh, discount is $250. Okay, now we have to press start. Now we have 950 left on the car and it will take 31 minutes for the washing machine to finish the cycle. That's it. Now we just have to wait until the machine finish its cycles and it will be done. The, the screen is going to show us the minutes and now we, we, we started in 31 minutes, now 30 minutes and it will be decreasing until it's done. For the dryer is basically the same. Once the washing machine is done, we have to bring the clothes inside. Always make sure the filter is clean before you put your clothes inside. So in this case, we have to clean this dust and take it to the garbage. So now the filter is clean. Then we just have to add 
our clothes. Um, I'm gonna show you these sheets. Some people do not use it, some others, they like it. Um, once you put your clothes inside, you can just throw one or two of these and it smells good and avoid static in your clothes. It's up to you if you want to use them. They are available at Dollarama, Walmart, any store. Most of the time we are choosing high temp. It will cost $2.25. And the same, we just need to use the laundry cart. Tap in the slot and press the start. It will take about 50 minutes to complete the cycle and your clothes will be completed, completely dry and ready to fold.